Remove lower rear implement bracket bolts. Install rear implement ethernet bracket. Start interior preparation by removing the rear window striker plate. Remove the manual holder by firmly lifting up. Remove rear upholstery by leaning towards seat and lifting up. Unscrew convenience outlet on right side of cab. Gently feed outlet and bezel through right fender upholstery. Lift right fender upholstery leaving the right side console in place. Remove rear cab cover and set aside. Remove steering controller bolts to access rear cab plate. Drill hole following the on-screen diagram. Be cautious of harnessing on the inside of the cab. Route harness through the hole, leaving roughly 10 inches inside the cab and set grommet. Take large round end of connector and feed through the bracket. Gently place connector housing over connector and secure. Secure harness to pre-existing harness and coil in a safe space. After removing the rear floor mat, plug harness into the big switch located on the lower left area of the cab. Harness will be labeled in correlation to the ports on the config switch. In the same area, bolt the power wire to the existing stud located on the rear wall. Lay remaining harness across cab following the graphic. Drill hole on rear floor mat following the diagram. After fitting grommet, feed middle breakout of cab harness and implement harness through the hole. Assemble ethernet switch and bracket. Plug harness into switch following the labels on the harness and switch. Attach fuse to Ethernet bracket. Install shield to Ethernet switch bracket. Remove the connector in the monitor port of the server and tuck away. Connect XA100 in place. Secure harness to existing ground stud in lower right portion of the cab. Drill a hole in the right hand upholstery. Use bracket as a reference to drill three smaller holes. Install bracket like you see on the right hand of the screen underneath the upholstery. Route the harness through the bracket and upholstery then through the spacer followed by the bracket on the left hand of the screen. Gently place the connector housing over the connector and assemble. Bolt to upholstery. Reinstall right hand fender upholstery. Install the rear cab upholstery.
bolt rear window striker in place. Slide the manual holder back into place. Lastly, install rear cab cover in update software.